Hey, what's going on, my friend? N.T. Izuchi here from ntizuchi.com. Uh, first of all, I hope you're having a fantastic day today. Uh, but what I'm going to do for you in this video is give you some free value training on some video um, optimization tips, okay? Some things that you can start literally incorporating into your business today, okay? In order for you to start getting boosted higher in the search engines, uh, you know, get higher rankings in the search engines so you can get more traffic, more leads, more commissions, more sales, okay? Because that's the real reason why we do video marketing, okay? Particularly if you're going to be in an online business. Now, I'm not exactly sure you watching the viewer right now, um, you know, if you're even doing video marketing, okay? If you, if, if you know why, you know, video marketing is important. Okay, maybe you've been online for a while and you've been trying to get your videos ranked. You just don't know uh, what it is that's stopping you from getting those videos ranked on the first page. Well, I'm going to provide some of that information for you. So don't just read what's on this board right now and then run off. Okay, don't just read it now. All right, I'm going to explain to you exactly how much some of these things uh, really go into your videos getting ranked on the first page. Because if you're doing video, you want to be on the first page. Okay, you want to be front and center of your audience so that you can start um, attracting people into your business. Okay, now for video. I mean, I love video. A lot of you guys who know me, some of my subscribers to my blog, my YouTube channel, even to my you know followers on Facebook, you guys know I do a lot of video marketing. Why? Because it just engages people more. Okay, it keeps people eyeballs on you more. Okay, it it it, it draws more traffic. Okay, it, it it converts sales better. It does all of that. Okay, from my personal blog, it literally has tripled the traffic to my blog, and it keeps people actually on my website much longer, okay? Much, much longer, okay? I'm gonna explain to you exactly how this all incorporates into online business and how this stuff can start to work for you. So basically, some of the key things that I wanna uh, uh, really stress. Now, there's a lot of things that go into ranking on uh, YouTube, but things tend to change over a while because YouTube and Google, they're, they're smart, okay? They know exactly, um, you know, how people are trying to fool them in order to get them ranked higher on, on the first pages of Google. Um, but there's some things that you need to just get down pat, okay? So the first things first, okay? Your video, your raw video, and this is the first point here, rename the raw video file that you have to the actual keyword. So for example, if I'm naming the name, if I'm naming this video, video optimization tips, okay? When you have that video saved onto your computer, rename the actual raw file. So you know how like, as you shoot the video, it'll say like DSC000143 or whatever it is, that's the name that the your computer your, or, your, or, or your camera gives it. Rename that video file to the name of your video. So if I'm gonna name this video optimization tips, that video needs to be, saved as video optimization tips. Why? Because it allows Google, okay, it's it, it, it's optimizing your video, okay? It tells Google exactly what this video is going to be about, okay? So you just, you're allowing Google to to bypass the people who aren't even gonna take the, the time to, to, to correct that, okay? That's something that's very, very simple, okay? And I think it's, plenty, it's pretty self-explanatory, right? So the next thing, Repeat your keyword phrase in your video transcript. Now, why do I say that, okay? Over time, Google understands that people are going to just uh, try to get... Well, first of all, what does Google want? What does YouTube want, okay? They want you to create video, okay, based on whatever it is that you're titling, okay, your video on. So if I'm saying video optimization tips, okay, I want to repeat that as many times as possible <clears throat> actually in the video, why? Because in the transcript, okay, in YouTube, YouTube, every, basically right now in this video, there's going to be the transcript area where it's going to be able to see exactly everything that I've said in this video, okay? And so they can pick up when they hear video optimization tips, okay? So that's another way for Google and YouTube to know, hey, that guy NT is actually making video on video optimization tips, okay? So they're smart, okay? Google has this stuff all mapped out. They know people send fake likes fake views, fake comments, and all that stuff, okay, to videos. People, they know people do that in order to get them ranked, okay, but this one simple tip has gotten a lot of my videos nailed to the first page of YouTube and Google as well, okay, so make sure you do that. Whenever you're saying or you're creating a video content on something, make sure you use that video, that, that, that keyword phrase, okay, as many times as possible in your video because it's going to show up in the transcript, okay. Next. Video up video SEO in the description area. Now this is pretty common. Okay, so again if I'm creating this video and it's going to be called video optimization tips What I want to do is in that description area. Okay, I want to have that keyword sprinkled in that um, In that description area not only that 
but you also want to have like words or what they call latent semantic indexing. So video optimization tips, I can have other words like video marketing tips or video optimization techniques, okay? Things like that because again, Google and YouTube, they're very, very smart, okay? They understand that if I'm saying video optimization techniques, that is very relevant to video optimization tips. They're smart, they know about it, so please <laughs> help yourself, okay, by doing that, okay? And the last thing before I let you guys go, is social sharing and engagement. Okay, now notice I have these right here with the arrows pointing to it because this possibly can be the most important thing, okay, when getting your videos ranked, okay? See, social sharing on these social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, all that stuff, when they get engagement from those social media platforms, see, that holds some weight because those social media platforms are some of the most highly trafficked sites in the world. Okay, so if your video is creating a buzz on these social media sites like Facebook, people are watching, people are commenting from there, people are subscribing to your blog or your YouTube channel from there, okay, that holds a lot of weight. And actually, social sharing is actually the new SEO. It's the new way of Google being able to know that your content is relevant because there's a lot of people on these social sites. And if your content is getting engagement from these social sites, I mean, I'm telling you, you're going to beat out a lot of that competition, okay? And engagement. Uh, people commenting, liking, sharing, that stuff, okay? And the thing is this, the shorter your video is, okay, you got to think about it. People have a very short attention span, okay? So if you're keeping your video short, okay, and you have some information, good information in that video, people are going to pretty much watch the entire thing, okay? So the shorter your video is, the longer that people watch the whole thing, okay? So... Again, these are some very, very simple things that you can literally start incorporating into your video marketing today, okay? So I hope you got some value from this, all right? If you're watching this and you're on my blog, okay, to the right side of this video is going to be an, uh, um, an opt-in form, okay? Please opt in and subscribe to my blog. I'm going to give you my tips on a daily basis whenever I create content, giving you guys free value, okay? This is, these are some of the fundamental things that you're going to need in order for you to grow a, a, a long-term substantial business online. No smoke and mirrors, okay? creating content like video, okay? All right, if you happen to be watching this um, and you're on YouTube, okay, in the description area is gonna be all my contact information, okay, my YouTube channel to subscribe to it. There's also gonna be my Facebook link to connect with me, my email, and then underneath this video is also gonna be the subscribe button to my YouTube channel where I give all sorts of good value all the time, okay? And if you're on Facebook, make some noise, like, comment, and share like crazy, okay? I really wanna hear, you know, what do you guys think about this content? If you liked it, if it's helpful, and you know, share it with somebody and tag somebody in it, whatever, if you think that they can get some value from this, okay? And last but not least, okay, if you're looking for a mentor online, okay, maybe you've been online for a while and kind of just been running around with like a chicken with his head cut off or maybe you're brand new and you need someone to kind of show you the ropes okay and looking for an opportunity can get in contact with me I will I will take you to the promised land I promise you that okay I do a lot of training with my team um pretty much on a day-to-day -day basis okay and I would love to you know be the mentor be the uh, sponsor that's going to help you uh, make some some substantial money online okay so without further ado take all those call to actions okay and I'll see you on the next training take it easy my friend